So it took me years to finally come up with a design I liked, and once I did, I started sculpting it in some clay. Then I scanned it with my phone and started to do a 3D model and started playing around with the animation. And then I went full back around and 3D printed the uh, skins because I wanted to actually build an animatronic version as well. These little wings are going to kind of uh, just rotate left and right, but then also kind of orbit. But yeah, I got one servo, slide this guy in there. Then the second servo, the first servo just kind of rotates the second one kind of left and right. And then the, that right servo is what actually makes the, uh, the wing rotate. So I have to kind of build the insides for the eyes. I made the actual eyeball. Uh, throw some LEDs in there and get that lit up. I've actually got the uh, outer portion of the, the eyeball that will kind of move up and down and we'll pop the actual eyeball in. Check it to see if it kind of moves around smoothly. I've got like a little backing to hold it in so it doesn't pop out. Hopefully there's enough room so it can actually orbit smoothly and seems to be fine. And then um, I'm actually gonna try to connect these two together. They're supposed to be one, one piece. So I'm just gonna glue them. And uh, just trying to put a little glue, not too much glue. Yeah, that's all right. Seems to be working. I've got these little bearings. They're going to help um, just when it attaches to the actual ship. It should spin a little easier. And this glue actually hold on really tight, really quick. I made the mistake on the first part. Glued in about two or three seconds, but it seems to work. I'm going to slide it into the ship here. I've actually got like a little ledge here where the uh, those bearings actually rest on so hopefully that actually it gets kind of like a nice smooth action that's kind of the gist of what it theoretically is going to look like once we get a motor in there a little servo so i've got like a little arm there so i'm going to take a little servo i built a little spot so it's all falling apart now I built a little spot so that way i can take an arm a, a little linkage arm from the arm of the servo to the arm of my eyes. So this is a little linkage guy. It kind of comes off of like uh, RC cars. I've got a bunch of different sizes. Uh, inevitably, finding the right size is kind of a pain, so I just get bloody everything. But that kind of is going to kind of, you know, allow it to control the, the movement of the eyes. Now I've got another piece that actually attaches to this full unit that uh, is actually what I need to attach to the servos to uh, control the movement of the eyeballs itself. Without this, then they won't kind of orbit. Or at least this is one way. I don't know if this is actually gonna work or not, but uh, I've got the one servo that's gonna control the uh, up and down. And then I'm gonna attach another servo to that and it's gonna control the left and right. If that doesn't work, I've got a few other possibilities, but uh, fingers crossed. And then now it should just move as one full unit. And it's important for that the servo in between there to be connected so that way, so they stay on the same axis as the eyeballs themselves. But yeah, that's about it. It's starting to come along, finally. I'm starting to feel like something. <laughs>